So this is the question number 43. It came in gate 2022 in set 2. So the question says, in a city, the chemical formula of biodegradable fraction of municipal solid waste is this. So chemical formula they have mentioned is this one. Okay. So the waste has to be treated by forced aeration composting process for which the aeration air requirement has to be estimated. Assume oxygen in air is 23%. And density of assume oxygen air is 23% and the density of air is 1.3 kg per meter cube. Atomic mass carbon is equal to 12, hydrogen is equal to 1, oxygen is equal to 16, nitrogen is equal to 14. Carbon and hydrogen are oxidized completely, whereas nitrogen is converted only to ammonia during oxidation. For oxidative degradation of one ton of waste, the required theoretical volume of air. So, so they, are, they have given the chemical formula of the uh, biodegradable fraction of the municipal solid waste and they are mentioning that the for composting process this air requirement is estimated. Assume oxygen in air is 23% and the density of air is this much. So C and H are oxidized completely where N is converted only into ammonia during oxidation. For oxidative degradation of 1 ton of waste the required volume of air will be. Okay. Whenever this kind of question comes the first approach should be to write the chemical equation so the chemical equation will be c 100 h 250 o80 and n plus o2 giving so the question is mentioning that the c and h are oxidized completely so when they are oxidized it will produce co2 plus H2O plus and N is converted to ammonia NS3. Okay, so they are mentioned they have mentioned N is converted only into ammonia and C and H are oxidized completely. So C and H are oxidized will produce CO2 and H2O. So this is the e chemical equation. So now we have to balance it. C is 100. So obviously C is 100 here. H is 250. So H is 250 and here 2H. Okay. Oh, A. So we have to balance of H now. So for H, so right hand side is 250. Uh, sorry, left hand side is 250 and the RHS is, suppose this is X. 2X plus 3. Okay. So the value comes out to be X is equals to 123.5. So here O2 H2 will be 123.5. So it will be 123.5 or wait, I will erase it properly so that we can write. So it will be 123.5 H2O. Hmm. So 123.5 H2O, this is the balancing for H2O, H for hydrogen, okay. Now for O we have to do oxygen for oxygen, RHS, uh, LHS is 80, 80 plus this, you can say X, 2X is equals to 200, so 2 into 100, 200 plus 123.5 because O is there. So 123.5. So if you calculate now X is here, you will get 121.75. So here the X value is. So now we can erase the X and we can write 123, 121.75. So 121.75 so now we have balanced our equation so so since we have balanced our equation we can now start the hmm. so so we know how to balance it now 
so from here we can write the molecular weight of this compound the com molecular weight of this compound if you calculate it you will get 2744 2744 gram the if you calculate this you will get 3896 gram hmm. so 3896 and so from here you can see if one ton of waste is present so question talks about degradation of one ton of waste if one ton therefore if one ton if one ton that is 1000 kg of waste is present if one ton of that is 1000 kg of waste is present oxygen required will be so this much for this much gram you need this much gram of oxygen so therefore one ton will be 3896 divided by 2744 into 1000 kg <clears throat> so which comes out to be 1419.825 kg okay so oxygen required is this much 141.1419.825 kg because i calculated for this much gram 2744 3896 gram of o2 is required so therefore 1000 kg so unitary method we are just apply now now in the question they have mentioned assume oxygen in the air is 23% and density of the air is 1.3 kg per meter cube so therefore now 1.3 kg of air contains is equals to 0.23 into 1.3 0.299 kg of oxygen so based on the question i have used now 1.3 kg this much kg of oxygen so therefore <coughs> so if 1.3 kg contain this much kg of oxygen so and we can write it another way like 0.299 kg of oxygen is present in 1.3 kg of air so based on the equation the oxygen required so this much oxygen will be present in 1419.825 kg of oxygen will be present in 1 by 3 divided by 0.299 into 1419.825 kg of air okay so this will comes out to be 6173.152 kg of air now <clears throat> the question is asking in terms of theoretical volume density we know theoretical volume and mass just now we calculated so using density is equals to mass by volume since we have to calculate the volume so volume is equals to mass by density mass we know just now calculated 6152 density given in the question 1.3 so value comes out to be 4748.57 meter cube so this is the value and option a is correct okay so the based on the question so the i will summarize the entire question so in a city chemical formula they have measured and they are telling that For one ton of waste, the required theoretical volume of air will be what is. So, based on the question, our approach is first we have to write the chemical equation, then we have to balance it. After balancing, we just have to apply unitary method. Like if one ton of kg of waste is present, oxygen required is for this much, this much amount of O2 is required. So then, for one ton, three at nine six by two seven four four into thousand, this much kg of oxygen is required. So now. <coughs> based on the given data we know 1 3.3 kg of air contains this much of oxygen so that means this much of oxygen will be present in this much amount of air 
similarly i did the unitary method so then from using the value given the question density is equals to volume mass by volume volume we calculated as 4748.57 meter cube thank you